Hi there, welcome to New Journeys Counselling. So, some of you may have already seen a few of my videos, and in one of my videos, I did, a, well, I was talking about a seven day personal audit challenge. So, if you sort of go onto my New Journeys Counselling channel on YouTube, you'll be able to see that video which details seven areas to look over seven days and to do an audit of. They include relationships, finance, work, and what some of the other things in there? I think spirituality and some other areas. So if you watch that video, it will give you a good idea. So what I thought I would do is do this video now where I'm just going to look at one of those areas and break it down for you so that if you do want to do an audit and an evaluation of that area, just to give you a few tips really. So the whole purpose of doing an audit is for you to sort of take stock of where you are in your life in that particular area, what are the things that are going well, what are the things you want to change, is there anything you need to get rid of or increase because what you're trying to do is lift yourself to a point where your finances, your career, your relationships are all at a good level and where you feel very confident that things are going well in those areas. So in this video I'm going to talk about career or job um, work. So for many people the job that they do, and that's why I've used the word career, job and work because to me they're three different things. Your job is just something that you go to. You may get a salary from that job but you may not necessarily enjoy the work that you do there. A career is possibly something where you've um, started at one level, you've moved slowly up in your career and you see that as something that you will continue to prog progress in. Now, the types of things that you would want to be asking yourself when you're doing an audit of your job, your career and your work is, is this the role that I am truly meant to be doing? Am I passionate about it? Do I enjoy my job? Would I prefer to be doing something else? What is it that's stopping me from doing something else? Do I have a good relationship with my colleagues? Is there anything I can do to improve the relationship with my colleagues or with my boss? And most importantly, am I happy at work? Now, I know for a lot of people, um, they have this philosophy that you don't have to enjoy your job. You know, you can just do it for the money and you can just, what's the point? You know, not everyone's happy at work. As a counsellor, I would say I slightly disagree with that. I'm not going to judge anyone and say that if you decide to remain in a job for financial reasons or at that point in your life you may not be able to just leave a job. But because of the amount of time you spend at work, my feeling is that it's better to have a role where you actually feel fulfilled, where you enjoy it and where it has like a better, um, you, you feel better really because if you're going to be spending eight plus hours at work every day and throughout that time you really hate what you're doing, that is going to obviously have a detrimental effect on how you feel overall. When you come home from work, you're not just going to be able to leave how you feel you know, with the job. It's going to have an impact on your relationships, especially if you are really stressed on a Sunday because you know you've got to go to work Monday and you really hate your job. There's been lots of studies to prove that people get really, really stressed um, even from Sunday all the way up to Sunday evening, purely thinking about the next day going to work. So that was just a quick video to sort of give you an idea of what you should be looking at when you're doing your personal audit. And this particular video was related to work, job, career. Now I'll be doing another few videos um, about this seven day audit challenge where I'll be looking at some of the other areas. Um, if you found this video useful, please leave your comments because I always read them and it's interesting to get your feedback. And also if you want to know more, please go to www.nujourneys.co.uk. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.